so from here we enter in my room uh, i can't really call this my room because i shared it with my dadi so my dadi uses this bed and there was my bed but my little cousin brother also stays with us so he sleeps there and uses that one so i can only uh, i don't have any other space in this home to keep my stuff so i just have to keep all my stuff in this particular room so that's what i'm gonna show you today so don't expect a fancy room tour as i must have mentioned it before so yeah that is our little dressing area where i have kept my things on top of that i don't have any of my stuff in these drawers or cabinets because that has been covered with other stuff of the other family members so i only have uh, my uh, stuff on top of that and these drawers are also mine so i have got this from dmart while back and I keep my stuff in this also. I'm gonna show you that in a while. Then I have this whole cupboard to myself, which is a great thing because I can dump anything and everything I want in there. That one isn't mine, that also has been occupied with other family members. So I'm gonna show you where and how I keep my ma uh, makeup and jewelry because it's very limited space here. So I'm not gonna show you anything in this cupboard. No, it's gonna be very messy. But let's just see okay so this is the area where i have kept all my makeup and all my jewelry this is my almost a uh, favorite section because that has everything i love so i'm going to show you one by one where and how i have kept my things you can also see some skincare products i'm going to show you that also so don't i don't have uh, much uh, fancy space or anything but i still try to keep things in an organized way so i'm gonna show you that first i'm gonna take out this basket and will show you what all i have got here so i have two baskets mainly this one and that one so it's very easy to organize things that way so i'm gonna show you what all i got in the first basket as you can see this only has a skincare products so i'm gonna go through them one by one very quickly so first what i see is a moha herbal face wash and then there is their foot care cream i really have started to like this brand a lot i love the scrub which is kept inside i'm gonna show you that in a while so this is this is that then my go-to thing my go-to product is patanjali aloe vera gel i cannot do without this one any day of this uh, any day of year i need to have this otherwise i will go mad because this is everything i need for my skin especially so this is what i have which is almost getting over and i need to buy another one then i have three products from biotic they are pringraj uh, oil which is hair oil then we have bio cucumber toner and then we have biotic mountain ebony hair serum which i don't like actually i don't like this serum but we'll have to give it another try i read biotic products then i have my most favorite plum a green tea face mist which is almost over like can you see there are only few pumps left so i need to buy this one also because this is a great product and we have three products from good vibes all of them are no sorry two of them are facial oils which i must have shown in my previous haul video so this is their cucumber and uh, cucumber and lemon under eye cream i quite like this one i also have finished almost about to finish this product then i have two facial serums which are i mean facial essence pomegranate and then we have lemon facial essence so that's there another product from patanjali i like a lot is their patanjali multani mitti face pack i also then I have a bio oil. I am currently starting to use this on a regular basis. We'll definitely make a video about this in depth because I really need to talk about this oil. Thank God I have their back backup because it, it can be difficult to find this product in a lockdown period. So thank God I have another one also. It's quite expensive for me but still it works. So I will. So that's there. Then I have good vibe aloe and cucumber detox face mask uh, definitely feels good on the face but don't know if this does anything to it then another product from moha is their moisturizing lotion so yeah that's also there i think most of the products are from moha company then i have two talcum powders because i need that for multiple purposes one is from 
oriflame nature secret talc and then we have a very famous white tone face powder so that's there then i have this random dubby with moisturizer filled in it i also like this pons ultra super light gel then i have this glycerin from random company for you know i keep making diy masks and hair masks and stuff so i need that for uh, need this one for that purpose so i have kept glycerin also then i have good wipe havana mango shampoo sample size product i really haven't used this one but will definitely use one day then i have aloe vera gel from aroma treasure but i do use it uh, sometime once in a while when i feel like using it so yeah that's there then i have another patanjali product i and guys of course this is not a sponsor video from patanjali or moha so just mentioning that we have moisturizer lotion from patanjali then i have this himalaya under eye cream then i have uh, don't get surprise or shock but i have nivea men sensitive after shave balm i heard a lot of things about this on youtube uh, people say that this can be used as a primer but i can't really feel that i have used this as a primer but it didn't really work that well for me i don't know maybe because of my skin type or what but yeah i just have kept it kept this with me next thing i can see here is biotic uh, bio carrot sunscreen i don't like to use sunscreen on my skin because it gets very greasy and oily and i do not like the feel of that on my skin but still we need to use sunscreen sometime when we go out and stuff so i don't definitely don't use it when i'm sitting at home but if i go out i try to use this but then again i don't like the feel of it so i don't know i just have this then i have this uh nika face mask so this is their skin secret face mask then i have some cara makeup remover wipes i love this a lot i can't stress enough this is a life saver for me whenever we are late from some function where we have a uh, worn a very heavy makeup and you are very late and you are very tired this comes very very handy and it's very great i definitely need to buy this another one it comes with 30 wipes and i almost running out of it if you can see there are only few left then i just have some random cotton for anything if we need this i have just kept it over here so yeah that's that was all in my first basket so as you can see i have some more skincare products over here because all of them i couldn't fit in the basket so i've kept some of them here so i'm going to show you that now so uh, the one i was talking about is this moha facial herbal scrub i love this product to death it's very nice it's just suitable for my skin and i just love this product so that is there then i have my shampoo moha shampoo and okay i really have a lot of products okay uh, one thing i like to mention these are aren't like my purchase i haven't really purchased any of these products my sister very kindly gave me all of this and i'm just so thankful to her thank you benal and ankit chichu for sending i mean giving these products to me because i am in love with this brand thank you so much for introducing me to this brand i will definitely buy more products from this so yeah enough of moha uh, sponsorship thing i am done with that so that that is the shampoo and we have another shampoo which is johnson's baby shampoo i use this shampoo because i use this shampoo because uh, it's sulfate free and my hair are very dry so i need to uh, use mild shampoos on my hair so that's why i use this johnson's baby shampoo then i have some of my uh, fish uh, face washes over there so i have almost uh, three face washes two are from himalaya and this one is uh, recommended to me by my doctor so i can't really reveal that but i have this two medimix i love this one a lot too this has done miracles to my skin i am uh, i really don't find it anymore in booge i don't know why but uh, i think i definitely think it's uh, available online so we'll buy that from online but to be honest i like this one better than this so yeah just a quick review 
देन आई हैव वन मोर ट्यूब ऑफ पतंजलि मुल्तानी मिट्टी फेस पैक बिकॉज जस्ट वी नीड बैकअप्स ऑफ आर फेवरेट थिंग्स देन आई हैव दिस हाईजी फैम इंटरमेट वॉश बिकॉज दैट्स ऑल्सो अ ग्रेट थिंग टू हैव एन नाव एम गो शो यू दिस बास्केट एंड दिस इज माई फेवरेट वन यू विल सी वाई इन अ वाई So coming to my favorite basket now you can see why I said it's my favorite one because it has all my brushes like this is all this these are all I own and you can clearly see I'm obsessed with brushes I'm not at all pro with makeup but I just can't stop myself from buying them most of them are from AliExpress or Shein or Amazon none of them are branded or any fancy stuff I have shown them almost all of them in my videos previous videos so you can go check that out so I'm just going to show you how I've kept them so I've, uh, I have this Erlin uh, uh, baskets which is mostly used as a pen stand but I use it as my brush uh, brush holder so in this I've kept all my eye makeup ke brushes and then there are another uh, there are a uh, face brushes which also has been kept in this container so i just have kept them in organized way so these all are my brushes which i use for my face makeup i mean base and contour and brush and stuff and again these one are uh, these are also for a face makeup purpose and uh, this container right here has a random brushes like this toothbrush shape brushes which aren't really useful i got this from aliexpress i only use uh, this brush for the contour purpose because it's very sleek and you can do a precise contour with this so yeah that's there then we have some cute little makeup uh, eye makeup brushes in here yeah i also keep my um, mcdonald ke and then we also have starbucks cups to keep this stuff because it's cute kind of and also a uh, thing you can also keep that as a memory so yeah i have this mac cafe ka mcdonald ka container in which i have kept all my eye makeup brushes not all some of them over there but just one set of eye makeup brushes are here so yeah that's that we are going to shut it back and keep here then i have kept my brush uh, what do we say what is called a uh, brush washing pad or something Bl brush cleaner yeah this is a brush cleaner pad which i think got from club factory it's very handy and uh, it clean it cleanses my brushes very nicely so i'm very happy it also has this vacuum thingy which you can st uh, stick to the wall or anything and it won't fall out so it's a great thing to use to remove your uh, dirt from your makeup brushes i don't have many brushes which are dirty but some of them are as you can see this one is very dirty and that one is also very dirty so we'll wash them in future whenever i will not feel lazy so yeah that's that i have also kept my makeup remover which is from garnier masala water this one is also my favorite also another bottle i mean another version of this which i have given to my bhavi it's not with me but it's i have used that one also and this one also both or, both of them are my favorite so yeah, i also keep my remo makeup remover here, over here and in this starbucks ka a container a cup i have okay you can see my name <laughs> i have kept all my beauty blenders and these are my favorite from park beauty blenders and sponges and some random eyelashes are sticking there so yeah i have kept there So this was all about my makeup brush ka basket. Let's move on. Now moving on, no, moving on. If you can see, I have these three similar uh, boxes, storage boxes. So I have all my makeup in these three boxes and one over there, that pink and transparent one. So I'm gonna show you one by one. I'm not gonna go in a detail. But show you how I have kept my makeup and things. So I have got these boxes from D Mart. All of them are from D Mart and they are very cheap. If I can tell you the price, wait. It's written here. It's for one twenty nine only. Don't you think it's very cheap and it's very good quality? So yeah, I'm gonna show you what all I have kept. I'm gonna take out all three of them and I'm gonna show you all my makeup. Okay. So the first box contains my favorite makeup products. All of them are what I use on a daily basis, or even not like daily daily because I don't use makeup. I don't wear makeup on daily basis. I only wear when I have to go out or in some function or stuff. So I almost use this product mostly because I love all of them. So you can see some of the contours are here. Oh, that that one is my favorite, Mac Fix Plus. So yeah, all of my uh, mascaras are here. Then we have my favorite lipsticks kept here, right here. All of them are my favorite shades. I wear wear mostly dark shades like these. So yeah. That is on there. Then I have my Fit Me foundation here, Nykaa Prep Me Prime uh, primer. Then I have my favorite concealer from Maybelline, which is Instant Re uh, Age Re uh, Rewind. Sorry, I'm Maybelline Fit Me concealers right here. We have my mascara. Oh, sorry, eyelash curler and curler bar foundation stick. This one is also my favorite. Huh? I like this one a lot. Then we have our Nykaa lipsticks over here. Then we have some Miss Claire, which I miss to miss a lot. Then I have my Pons BB cream, which is my favorite favorite product. And we have some beauty blender lying here, lying here around very randomly. Then I have this mirror I got from Max, which I like a lot. Then I have this Fit Me loose powder, and we have my brow product, and another tube of Pons BB cream, and another you know eyeshadow pencils. And we have Maybelline Colossal Kajal in blue color, and all the go-to products you know are kept here. So that's the first container or the bar or storage box, whatever you call it. I keep my makeup in this one, and I'm gonna show you the other one now. 
other makeup box has mostly my palettes which I don't have many but yeah I also have kept two of my foundations if you've seen my previous vlog or video you know that I by mistake order very light shade for my skin so then I purchased the darkest shade from wet n wild and then I use this both like I mix it together and then make my skin tone shade and then I use it so yeah we are, we have solved the problem of this light shade so we have two foundations here with me then I have three of my loose powders kept in here which are let me rose powder then we have let me whitening whitening rose powder and then we have blue heaven color rose powder so out of three this one is my most favorite one i use this a lot so yeah my loose powder collection very tiny loose powder connection collection then inside i've kept okay a random tie is flying around here then i have a what is this music flower eyeliner gel in brown color so yeah i'm very bad with eyeliner i don't know how and when i would use this but we have that then we have maybelline ka dream touch blush cream blush i like this a lot so yeah that's there then we have all of my eyeshadow palette and blush palette this is everything i have so i'm gonna show you one by one we have this swiss beauty car 32 forever eyeshadow palette which is amazing very neutral shades and i almost have all all pal palettes in neutral shades only because i'm not at all pro and i don't know what to do with colors much so i just go with uh, basic colors then i have two shivana okay this one is shivana colors ka highlighter and contour palette so this has all the highlighter shades you will need in your life and this also has a contour sh shade also so that's that then i have two blush palettes from shivana i don't know why i purchased two of them because i really don't need this much of blush but still i have them because they're very cheap actually so it's no harm to buy multiple palettes they are both in a different variant huh? this one is 04 and this one is 03 so yeah that's that then I have more palettes from Shivana Colors, which is eyeshadow palettes. Shivana Colors Double Exposure Eyeshadow Palettes. Very unique and very classy colors in this palette. Like I don't usually use blue and green and pink color, but yeah. Baki ke to do very neutrally. Oh sorry, this one is new. Okay, here. We have Shivana Color Double Exposure Eyeshadow Palettes. So this is that. Then which I shown by mistake is this one. It's, it's Maybelline The Nudes. Very, you know, classic and basic which we all Indian girls should have, especially the beginners, is this palette. So yeah, go for it. Buy it. It's very, uh, you know, uh, it's not very hard to use. Like their color is very, uh, very basic and natural. So yeah. So that's there. Then we have another palette which says MAC. But no, this isn't MAC. I just got it from a local store and I'm sure it's just a fake brand. In a very beginning. Uh, when I started to love makeup, I got this one. So, yeah, these are all the shades. I haven't really used it that much, but yeah. Then we have another Sivana products, which is Sivana Color Simmer Brick, which is almost a highlighter and a blush too. So, yeah, that's there. Then I have my Fit Me Compact Powder line around here. So, yeah, that was all in this box. I hope this is a, this video is not boring for you because I'm just showing stuff I don't know but if you have made it till here then thank you so much for watching my videos so we're just gonna move on now so this is the last uh, box which has this is my makeup products and I'm just gonna show you this palette which is my uh, oldest and I can say like my first ever makeup purchases so I uh, genuinely wanted to try makeup when I started, genuinely wanted to try makeup I asked my dad to you know kind of uh, make an arrangement for me to get this because this is an Indian brand it's from US so yeah this one is my favorite palette also because it has all all the beautiful colors too you can do so much with this and it smells amazing i'm gonna sniff it again right now <sighs> this is amazing and the thing is they all are shimmer shades so use your tan transition uh, correct you know correct palette for transition and then you can use this palette because it has all the shimmer shades so yeah that's that then in this box i have uh, almost all the random products okay this pouch contains all my uh, earrings which my baby recently got for me from mumbai and i'm gonna show you okay wait let me show you one or two of them so yeah, this Indian Jumka type and then we have this card. So all of them are my earrings. I don't keep my jewelry with my makeup but I can get to organize this. That's why I just keep it here. So in this box, as you can see, it's very messy and has all, you know, random stuff possible. So I have another pump tube of Pons BB cream. We have another one. I definitely have more Pons BB cream. Okay, then we have uh, most of this contains, I say, eye pencils and lip pencils and eyeliner and stuff. And some of the lipsticks are also here. The darkest shade, darkest shade I own is this one, which is Matte Kiss Beauty. Does this have shade? Yeah, 112. It's a very vampire shade, but I like bold shades on my lips. So yeah, that's that. I also have some of my mascaras also, like Color Essence Ka or this random brand mascara, which definitely must have like, you know, dried up by now. But yeah, so that's all this uh, box contains. I also have gel liner for Music Flower again in a black color. And I have Patanjalika Sondare Anti-Aging Cream, which cost a lot to me. This small dibia is for like how much 400 rupees it's just like a moisturizer cream but it claims that it has real particle of gold so that's why it's very expensive so yeah that's there i also have this random brush kept in here i have this eyelash cutter bar which is empty of course so yeah that's all okay another mascara or lipstick yeah this one is a lipstick now i have this huda beauty obviously not the original one fake huda beauty makeup brushes 
which again was a gift to me by my cousin's sister. So I haven't used it yet, but she knows that I love makeup and brush. Like obsession of brushes, I, I mean my obsession for brushes is insane. So she knows that, and that's why she gifted me this one. So we have many brushes, which is very convenient when we are traveling. So yeah, that's there. I've kept them over here. Then I have this dabba which I got from a Club Factory, and I'm very glad that I got it because it was only for like 40 to 70 rupees, and it has uh, it's actually cotton pads, like for removing your makeup or other skincare purpose. You can use this cottons, and they are more than thousand. Uh, thousand pieces like damn it it's very cheap 80 rupees mein kaun dega aapko 80 bhi nahi shayad it was for 40 to 50 rupees ka hi tha shayad i got it from club factory when they uh, started you know they were very new that time and the prices were really cheap so luckily i got it and since then i'm using this one and i'm very you know glad that i got it. yeah this whole dabba contains a cotton pads not actually pad it's just a cotton key small uh, you know what do we call it uh, patch or something so yeah that's that so now only that dabba has my makeup other than that all of that has my jewelry so we're gonna go through that also so i'm gonna show you what's there Let's take out this one first so we can get finished with makeup. So this doesn't have much interesting products. I'm gonna just show you like this only. So yeah, this has a makeup sponge and my some unused uh, foundation, and we have like makeup muse, and then we have this three compact from Maybelline, and I also have this glitter palette from some random brand, and then we have more products over here. So these are all my makeup stuff kept in this. Let me cut a bar yet. So I'm gonna take all of these now out and then gonna show you what all I have and how I've organized my jewelry. So let's get started. So this box again is a DMAT product and it's very old guys. It's almost like 10 to 15 year old and the quality is very good. I got it from Mumbai like DMAT wasn't even here there then and it's only for one. Wait what? Okay yeah this is only for. 119 rupees so yeah that is my box where i have kept all my ne neck pieces like uh, so when you open it we have this pouch where i've kept my uh diamond ke ye bangles because it tends to get uh, dark very easily because obviously these aren't real diamonds so imitation kabhi bhi kaise bhi kharaab ho jata hai to usko bahut dhyan se rakhna padta hai that's why i've kept this in this pouch so they don't get dark very easily so yeah that's my first pouch then i have kept all my neck pieces in here like you can see this is my favorite one yeah i can use this in my western outfit also and on indian outfit that's why i like it like this one a lot then i have the random neck pieces i don't know if i'll ever use this or what then we have some more okay this gorgeous piece is a gift from my sister-in-law she lives in georgia so she kindly got this for me and i really haven't used this yet because as you can see it's very it's really packed so yeah some more neck pieces this is a very indianish okay we have more all of them are neck pieces so you can see uh, you know understand what i was talking about so i've just kept all my necklaces and neck pieces in here so yeah that's there let's put everything back and move on to other box so i've got like more three boxes out and i'm gonna show you what's all in there so this little box has my random you know things very small and uh, dainty thing the sculptures are very very nice dude i love their size and the pattern and diamonds and everything so i have similar type of i think i have three of them in different colors so yeah there are the clutches and then there are rings i'm a hoarder of rings guys i love big and chunky rings so that's there I just have kept it here. I don't know why, but just you know, keep it. So I just kept it. Anyway. Now these two boxes have the bangles. Uh, mostly, or I can say all of them actually. All of them are a gift from my in-laws. I mean, uh, when we get engaged, it's our tradition to uh, give a bride bangles. So. Uh, these are all, all of them are from them so i think uh, my sister-in-law and my mother-in-law chose this and i really love their choice because dude just look at the beauty i love all of them see this these all are limitation now by the way none of them is gold or anything so yeah i'm just gonna show you a close-up see the beauty i love these two pair a lot i mean these two as a pair i like them a lot even these one white bangles oh my god i'm definitely gonna wear a lot of these after i get married you know newly married bride looks very good with bangles so that's there and then i have this uh, separate box for chura it's all one like it's uh, kept for one chura only like i'm gonna show you how we'll definitely use this in one of my marriage functions oh my god this is so beautiful 
now i have to count more three boxes and i'm gonna show you what all i have in these boxes so the first box has mix i think all of them have mixed things now nothing is uh, kept uh, in order as like you know separated with categories or stuff these are my bangles which i like i mean i love these bangles a lot i got this from bulleshwar market mumbai and i wore this on my engagement day so yeah this has a uh, special feelings this uh, has all i mean I got everything in a set like you know uh, earrings and then we have neck piece and then we have bangles and everything oh sorry so yeah, I have all of them in here I love such kind of neck pieces a lot if you can see and these earrings and more bangles and we have more random earrings and I'm going to show you the next piece I wore on my engagement day because I like that a lot and I'm going to buy more of Uh, such kind of neck pieces in future because it just gave me a very classy princessy look so yeah i'm going to show you exactly what i wore on my engagement day so here it is can you see this beauty i'm in love yeah so that's that now i'm going to show you everything like you know ek ek product batane jaungi to kitna lamba video hai i'm sure abhi tak ye bahut hi lamba hai aur most of you have been felt to very bored but you know what this okay then i have some random uh, ye kya bolte isko bindi which i think most of them are from my engagement only i got most of this when i got engaged so that's the first step up in next one i have very random things like literally very random things yeah so we have this bangle kept here some bindis this beautiful neck piece and this earrings which again are gift to me from my sister in law thank you jenal i love this a lot so yeah that's there I have another pair of earring kept here. So yeah, this boxes comes really handy to keep things, you know. And the last but not the least, this one is my favorite, favorite, favorite of all because first thing I love Navratris a lot. Second thing I love oxidized jewelry like a crazy girl, literally. So almost all of them are from Mumbai, um, Kolaba Causeway, or we can see Fashion Street or Bandra Hill Road. So all of them are from there and very old. Like these have been with me for like more than ten. Seven to ten years, so yeah, I love this a lot, and thankfully I have this box which is very easy to organize my things. I initially got this for my uh, keeping my nail pins, but then I thought it's it'll be a good idea to store my jewelry in this. So yeah, there it is. So as you can see, we have different compartments, and they are not in any particular order. So I've just kept things randomly. This one has all my uh, earrings. I love these, yeah, I love these a lot. I can wear this daily also, but I just love them a lot. All of them are very beauty and pretty. Can you see this jumkas? I'm not a big fan of jumkas though. I like such earrings more than jumkas. Then this section right here has all the good big finger rings. Can you see them? Oh my god! Can I wear all of them now? There are all different shape and size and patterns. Okay, this is very unique. I recently got this from Fashion Street Mumbai. I remember this because it's a recent recent purchase. Then we have this mirror finger ring. I just love all of them, dude. I have a lot of them. So that's there. And then I have more earrings kept in here in a separate plastic pouches because I fear they can get dark and black. So it's better to keep them the way they are supposed to be kept. So yeah, that's there. We have some more bangles and stuff here. Then we have more. neck pieces here okay we have oxidized kind of neck pieces here hey guys do you want like proper try on haul for like try on thing for jewelry please if you do so then please let me know in the comment section comment section below i can do like a, a one on one try on haul so you can see all of the pieces very in close up or this one is also very old but my most favorite i like this piece a lot so yeah that's what i was saying if you want i can make a very uh, separate video just for my jewelry so i can show you everything in detail and what all i have i'm just going to show you this um, you know very quickly so more neck neck pieces over here i kept them more, some of them are also from ali express ha huh? then i have more earrings like golden uh, golden ke hote hain jo ye sare oxidized ke hai to iske andar maine sare golden earrings rakhe hain then we have some more random things here Okay yeah this one i remember it has uh, this bracelet which my kaki got got me on my birthday like my auntie and this one is a bracelet which came with a watch which my bhaiya got for me from china so yeah some more earrings are kept here like you can see some more golden earrings and this pair yeah very colorful pair of earrings and then i have this dabbi which has okay more earrings and normal rings and stuff like that so yeah this is all this is how i kept almost 
most amount of my jewelry so yeah that's all as you can see it's all empty i've shown you everything so yeah this is where i kept keep my jewelry and makeup as of now because i really don't have any other space in this house anymore so it's all like here i have to keep everything here so yeah I know video बहुत ही ज़्यादा लंबा हो गया इसलिए मैं जल्दी जल्दी लाइक वेरी क्विकली गोना शो यू वोट आई हैव इन दिस ड्रॉर्स सो दिस फर्स्ट ड्रॉर हैज़ ऑल दी रैंडम थिंग्स पॉसिबल इन दिस वर्ल्ड इट हैज़ माई कोम दैन वी हैव दिस खाली बॉटल ऑफ जॉनसन्स बेबी विच आई कैट फॉर सम डी आई पर्पज दैन वी हैव पेपर सोप थिंग दैन इन दिस डब्बा आई हैव ऑल ऑफ माई वॉचेज एंड एवरी थिंग वी हैव दिस रैंडम मिरर कैप्ट योर आई डोट नो फॉर वॉट रीज़न and then we have this cute little studs from club factory and all of them are very cute and very uh, trendy we have some tissue papers over here some more makeup products right there so yeah that's all i have it's very mess messy sorry for that the second drawer has all of my perfume and body sprays and a uh, deodorants and everything i love my makeup of or uh, what makeup ek tha i love my perfume collection a lot if you want in depth video about only my makeup uh, perfume not makeup perfume collection please let me know in the comment section below or dm me on instagram i will definitely make because i am very proud of my collection it's not at all branded or anything it's very basic and very you know मिडिल क्लास थिंगी आई ओनली हैव दिस परफ्यूम विच इज़ एक्सपेंसिव बाकी सारे वेरी नॉर्मली है सो एम गना शो यू दैट आई ऑल्सो हैव दिस टाइटन का स्किन एंड देन वी ऑल्सो हैव वन सारा का रोलर ओवर देर वेर इट इज राइट हियर या राइट ओवर देर एम गना शो यू एवरी थिंग इफ यू वॉन्ट इन डिटेल आई ऑल्सो हैव सम क्यूट बॉटल्स लाइक दिस वन ओके सम ऑफ देम आर गिफ्ट ना आई वन यू परचेज दैम some of them are of gift from my sister in law only so yeah thank you general once again for gifting me this so that's there that's what's in the next second drawer then the third drawer has all of my nail paints i like painting my nails but sadly i haven't painted them now and they are very cheap and i know it definitely looks so ugly but we're going to go with that because it's lockdown time and we don't feel like doing anything at all other than cooking actually especially for me so yeah this has all my nail paints and uh, nail filer it's also here we also have nail remover kept here so i like my nail paints to be kept like this only because whenever i need uh, in any uh, you know i need to paint my nails i can just uh, randomly pick any color and paint my nails so yeah i have quite a few nail paints though okay all of them are very nice and i like all of them so yeah i have also kept some of them are over there which uh, okay some of them are very old and i don't like them but i just don't feel like throwing them so they are just kept at the back of the drawer and these are all new ones so yeah that's there and the last drawer has my hair straightener then we have my hair dryer this pouch has my epilator i'm going to show you that bit so this pouch has my happy little kept in here i keep this in pouch so whenever we are traveling or anything it just comes so, just comes so handy so yeah that's there we have this mini straightener kept in here so yeah this has my hair products i can say and one hair removal product too so yeah that was all in this drawers now coming to the top of this thing which i showed you in earlier early. so this uh, these all are my like you know daily products i use this has uh, mostly my medicines and everything i don't know why i, I don't need these many medicines so i still keep it here i mostly have my medicines and there is also one lip balm over here so yeah this apply for pet medicines and then this one is i got uh, which is i got it from uh, from diwali actually my father yeah papa only bought this home for me so i've kept all my uh, little ties and scrunchies and uh, this uh, little what do you call crutches and everything in here so yeah that's there I have kept very random things in here, some pluckers and other hair ties and crutches which I need daily, like daily in uh, life. Then I have some of my eyeliner and kajal and lip balm kept in this bag. So this tray I like a lot, but I know this it's not the best way to use it. I am definitely going to whenever I will, you know, have my own personal space, I will definitely use this as a good decor piece. I promise. And I'm going to show that too also in a video. Now this tray, I mean this basket has this uh, little uh, decorative piece which my very cousin, my very little cousin of mine. 
got for me when he went to some trip so i just keeping this with me since then then this pouch has all the other hair ties and everything then we have more patanjali card uh, aloe vera gel then we have my hair oils from patanjali then we have another product from moha which is very crazy we have this massage oil then this um, deodorant which i use on a daily basis has been kept on the top of the dresser so we can use this very conveniently we also have this synthol ka deo stick and some other random products so yeah with that we have finished this video almost